To me, to me! Go wide! Woohoo! Here it comes, Junior Flugelboomer! <laughs> to you, Fleeker! <laughs> oh, got it! Now for my famous flying saucer flick. Watch and learn, Flugels. Okay, ready when you are. Here goes! Flugelet! It's a woman's! Hi! Hurry up, you two! Uh-oh, <coughs> nice catch, Flo. Can I have a party in the park, too? Sure, when it's your birthday. <sighs> I can't believe my little girl's turning five already. <coughs> the coast is clear. <coughs> Thanks. Toss me the flying saucer. Flaker, go on. Wait for me. I got it. I got it. <coughs> <coughs> Okay. There goes our flying saucer. I'll get it. Not if I get it first. You check that way, I'll go this way. Okay, Captain. Ah! Monster! Ah! Good monster! Ah! Fleeker? <laughs> See you, monster! <laughs> Fleeker? <laughs> what? Huh? Whoa! What was that? And where did it go? We've got to tell Flo. <sighs> How long does it take to find a little flying saucer? Forget the flying saucer. We found something better. A big pink floaty thing. What was it? We have no idea. Well, it sounds like this big pink floaty thing is today's project. What are we? Freaker. Boomer. Whoa. We find, question, and explore. And there we go. Okay. So where is this thing? Well, it looks like it kind of disappeared. Yeah, uh, but first, it, it chased Fleeker around the room. It chased you, and you ran? Well, yeah. Th technically, there was running, but it had a face. Okay, so the thing chased Fleeker around the room, and then it vanished, and it had a face? It did have a face. Fleeker's no scaredy, Flugel. He's really brave. Usually. Okay, just wait till we find it again. Then you'll see how brave I am. Really brave. Wait up! Ah! Heavy! Ah! Is this the same one? I don't know. Fleeker said it had a face, and this one just has a... Uh, something. A number. Five to be exact. What is this thing, and how can it float? Yeah, and why did it chase Fleeker? Is it me? I've got a question. Where did its face go? Any guesses? Yes. I think this is a monster, too. Disguised as a five. Huh? Well, monster or not, we've got to look closer. It's the only way to find out. <laughs> <sighs> Hi. <laughs> uh, hi. Five? Not very chatty. Five doesn't seem to talk. Careful, Flo. It's the silent ones you gotta watch out for. Maybe he's just shy. Don't be shy, Five. We're friendly. <laughs> huh? <gasps> he does talk. What did you say to him? Well, I don't know. I don't speak monster. Well, whatever you do, don't make him mad. <clears throat> what a handsome monster you are. I don't think he was talking at all. I think he makes a funny noise when you rub his face. Well, don't rub him the wrong way. Wait, what's this around his neck? <laughs> He's getting away! No, back to Good job. Nice catch! How did he get so small so fast? Beats me. Five sure can do a lot of strange things. I think he's calmer now, Boomer. You can let go. 
The monster just blew air in my face. Five? No! You know what I think? I think it was filled with air. I don't think it was alive at all. You mean it's not a monster? I knew that. <laughs> yeah, I was I was testing you. How could something this small get so big? Good question, Boomer. And the answer is... Stretching! Look how rubbery it is. Let me have a go. Oh, no, me! <laughs> it is rubbery. Right. And that's how it's able to hold all of that air. So, guys, what do you think the humans use it for? Um, well, you see, Boomer, I, uh... Oh. We don't know, do we? Not a clue. <gasps> Blue alert! Humans! Why are they back? Let's look in here first. Yeah. Let's find out. Follow me, Flugels. The party decorations just won't be complete without the five balloon. The, the five, five balloon! balloon. Uh-oh. It's got to be here somewhere. What color is it? It's pink, and it has a big five on it. <gasps> <gasps> so these balloons aren't monsters after all. They're used for decorations for happy human events. Oh, no! Like the girls' birthday party, which I think we can safely say won't be happy. The girl's gonna be sad without her five balloon. And it's all our fault. We've got to get it to her. Yes, but it will be dangerous. There's a risk of us getting caught. Danger? Risky? I'm your man. No more Mr. Scaredy Flugel for me. <sighs> That's it, Bleaker! Lots and lots of air! Oh, it's working! Uh, Dad, we have to go. We'll be opening up presents soon. Okay. Oh, no! The humans are leaving! It's time for the famous Fleeker Flugel flying sprint! <laughs> well, we tried. Let's go back to the park, Dad. <laughs> Nearly there! Nearly there! Oh no! They're leaving! We've got to get them back! Boomer can do it! Go, Boomer! Oh. Who's that? Yes! Junior Flugel Boomer! Yeah. Hey, Dad! Here's the five balloon! Good job, Luke! Now your sister will have the best birthday ever! Yes! Alright! <laughs> Preparing to send mission report balloon. Ready, Flugels? Flugels? Ready! Uploading report in T minus three, two, one, zero. Captain Fleeker Flugel reporting. Go ahead, Flugels. Today, we encountered a not at all scary thing here on Earth called a balloon. <laughs> they do not frighten brave Flugels such as myself. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. But they sure are floaty and bouncy and fun. First officer, Flo Flugel reporting. We learned that balloons are made of a stretchy rubber material so that they can fill with air and use that stretchiness to get bigger and bigger and become pretty colorful globes that humans use to decorate happy events. Junior Flugel Boomer reporting. Balloons are super light when they're filled with air and they whirl around when you let the air out. Oh, and they make a funny squeaking sound when you rub them, like this. Good job, Peter. Hey, huh? I found something else you can do with balloons. It's a balloon that's a flugel. It's a balloogle. Classic oh, boomer. boomer. <laughs> 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 I don't think the Flug National Anthem is supposed to sound like that. Now, one more time. <sighs> That's the ship's alarm. Action stations, team. Activating ship's detector probe. Starting camera deployment protocol. Boy Human is home from school. Report, what are we looking at? It's a Wednesday. <gasps> That's soccer practice. Uh-oh. Not again. This may get messy. Buckle up. Here we go. Uh, 
Heavy boots are down. Yo, oh, incoming! Brace yourselves, Googles! Huh? Luke, sweetheart, get your muddy self in the shower. Almost time for dinner. Okay. Phew! Hey, guys, what's that? <sighs> Curious. Seems boy filming brought something else back from school today. What are we waiting for? Let's find out what it is. <laughs> Follow my lead, Junior Tilt the River. Approaching no box thing. Seems harmless enough. Wow. Let's take the scientific approach. Could be something inside. Or we could just do this. Is it? Uh, I don't know, but I think we found today's project. What are we? We're Legos! Tweaker! Boomer! Whoa. We find, question, question and explore everywhere we go! It sort of looks like a flugelhorn. Only bigger and shinier and gold-colored. If it's a flugelhorn, maybe you can hear things through it. Fascinating. What a peculiar sound I'm picking up. I'll get a reading. Actually, that was my tumble. Kinda hungry. Check out those buttons! Uh, I got it! It's one of those phones the humans are always using. Yes, I've got that sound! See? Uh. Hello? This is Flo Flugel speaking. Hmm, no answer. And anyway, Human phones aren't big and gold-colored like this. Uh, maybe it's one of those. Or a cup to eat a year's worth of ice cream out of. Wait a minute. I've got it. It's metal and shiny. It's one of Boy Human's toy spaceships. Yes! Uh-huh. I'm not so sure, Fleeker. What? No, this part here's the engine. Look! This is where the crew sleep. Obviously a very bendy and thin crew. Uh, and here's the entrance, see? Maybe not that way. Ah, wait a sec. If I just turn around like this. Yeah, there we go. Ah, ah it's a little tight, but I think we can see that I was right. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, is your boodle stuck in there? Uh, that would be a yes. <laughs> well, I'll just pull you out. Here we go. Oh, oh, you're stuck. Fear not. I am an expert boodle unsticker. I'll be out any second. Maybe if I wiggle a bit. No dance. If we simply apply the laws of physics, we'll be able to lever him out of there. Boomer, push it back as hard as you can, please. Aye, aye. Junior Fugo Boomer, careful you don't let go of that. That is an order. Yes, sir. Luki! Guys, shh! Boomer! Are you in the shower yet? There's no time to get Flicker out. Boomer, we'll have to hide him. I have a plan. Come on, Lip! Hey, what's going on? Who <laughs> turned out the lights? Shh! Mom Hooman is coming! <sighs> oh, look at all this mess. I guess trumpets are harder to play than they look. Why did Mom Hooman try to blow through this trumpet? She almost blew me right out of here. That's it! We can blow you out! Booms, I think your cheeks are probably too tiny. They're the only cheeks I have. Hmm, blowing air? Let me see. Aha! Uh -huh. We'll use this to blow bleak ground. What's that? So we put What's this going in. What's going on? Oh, yeah. Ready, Boomer? Jump! Jump. <laughs> 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 if only we had some. 
something heavy to drop onto it. I heard heavy and drop. Not good. Ha! <laughs> good luck getting up there, Flo. Now, if you want my advice, I'd go with some climbing, swinging, and a huge leap onto the shelf and kick the book off. <laughs> or I could just do this. That's an odd noise for a spaceship to make. I'm starting to think this might not be a toy spaceship. Wait! Fleeker, jump on the pump! Boomer, press that button down! <laughs> now, a big jump, Fleeker, and Boomer, press those buttons together! <laughs> My feet sound great! So that's what this is! A trumpet is a musical instrument. And boy, Hooman is taking lessons at school. Hoomans must use this to play music, because they don't have flugelhorns. You know what? We should play the Flug National Anthem on this. It would add something to the project. Okay, follow my lead. This means a big jump, and this is a small jump. And Boomer, press whichever buttons I point to. Ready? Bleaker. And you, Boomer, this is way better than before. Yeah, because this time we're having fun. I'll say. Is that Luke playing upstairs? No, stop! Mom and Dad, who an alert? What's that? Faster, eh? Ha-ha, <laughs> I love a challenge. Oh, think, Flo, think. Uh, <laughs> hey, why'd you stop the music? Dad and Mom, who are coming? Whoa! How did it all... We heard you playing, Luke. Really? It sounded That's amazing. Right. How about a tune while we're here? Okay, I guess. <laughs> Preparing to send mission report trumpet. Ready, Flugels? Flugels? Ready. Uploading report in T minus three, two, one, zero. Captain Fleeker Flugel reporting. Go ahead, Flugels. Today we discovered that whilst humans don't have our most excellent flugel horns, some do have shiny musical instruments called trumpets. Getting your boodle stuck in one can lead to an awesome report. First officer, Flo Flugel reporting. We figured out that to make a trumpet work, you need to blow air down the pipe and press the buttons at the same time. And that makes music. Junior Flugel Boomer reporting. I played the Flug National Anthem with my feet. You know, maybe I could try walking with my flugel horns. That deserves a sticker. Hey, we got, got a bonus, bonus sticker. sticker. Boomer, where are you going? If we can get bonus stickers for getting our boodles stuck in stuff, I bet I can earn lots of them. <laughs> 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 <laughs>